Here we go. You ready? Oh dear. We're doing the thing. We're doing the thing, Rue. The thing's happening, Rue. You turned up just in time. We're doing the thing. Hello everybody, welcome, welcome, welcome. As always, it's me, Mythic. Today we are looking at one of the most fun, enjoyable, stupid, hilarious, just brilliant decks. This is probably the most me, Mythic deck I've ever played on the channel. You don't take one turn, you don't take two, three, just, it, you just go nuts. It's so much fun. Definitely give it a try. Um, a big shout out goes to MTG arena original decks um, who i originally saw this video or the deck from uh, literally tweeted out to me by one of my moderators so please do go and show them some love there will be a link in the description um, apart from that if you like the deck make sure you go on to like the video make sure you bang a comment down below as to what you think if you want to see more crazy decks like this and don't forget to subscribe because it's free apart from that let's get into the gameplay go okay so the deck we are playing um, and i want to give a massive 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 shout out uh, to MTG Arena Original Decks. Yeti, can you post a link for me um, to um, the guy that we saw this deck on? Um, that'd be really good. Um, and what we'll do, if you just keep it copy and pasted, um, when we've got a few other people in that are asking about it, we can make sure we give him suitable kudosy shout-outs. Um, so this isn't a net deck. Uh, it's not a copy of someone else's his deck. It's uh, uh, three cards that come together to make a really nice combo, and then I've built my own shell around it. So, frankly, there's only um, a few cards in common. So, actually, from the deck, the uh, you know, if you take the lands out of the equation, um, it's literally just uh, the Elrond's Epiphany, the Double Visions, and the Mesa of, Alu of Aluna. In uh, this chap's original deck, there was some Storm's Wrath, which I've added, but to be honest with you, part of me is thinking of taking it out for something else. Don't think it's n entirely necessary. I think there's other good stuff that we could have, like maybe more Mystic Reflections and or another Nico Defies Destiny. Um, but apart from that, they're the only three sets of cards that are the same. Um, so Doomscar wasn't in here's Raven form. It, like Basically, so I've put a Foretold package around it, which I really, really like, especially as... Um, the main card is foretold. So the idea basically is um, take millions of extra turns and just generally be utterly fucking obnoxious. Um, it's... I think this is possibly like the most mythic deck that I've ever played on the channel so far. This, if you want to know what personifies me, this. This evil shit personifies me pretty much. Basically me being a douchebag. Yeah, I mean, but then again, saying that though, the, the, the decks that you guys and girls predominantly end up watching are my douchebag decks. Um, and it's in standard again. So it just proves that the new set is actually vaguely interesting because it's got me playing standard and not got me playing historic at the moment. So, you know, interesting. Interesting, yes. I know why the hell you're still around. Why is that? Kudos. Right, let's see what we can do. Any companions? No companions. Okay. So. Play the Rawgrin Triome. Play the Island. Then start foretelling stuff. Okay. We can get rid of the Vessel, which is nice. So having this not come back is pretty sweet. Because hmm. we don't want any 5-5s. Five 5-5s fives. Five fives are scary. Uh, okay. So... We'll probably get rid of the Cleric, I should imagine, here. Um, what we'll, In fact, what we'll do is we'll play White Manor 
will foretell this, leaving up our blue, and then we'll raven form the cleric before it gets too big. We can deal with one ones. And we can always use Mythos to copy their 5-5 five five to jump block it anyway. Read it shit for brains. I know why the hell I am still around. It says I know why the hell I am still around. Reread it shit for brains. It says why am I still around. Oh, I know why the hell I am. I know. That's not. It's not. You, you need to sort your fucking grammar out. So we'll, to be honest with you, we're just going to Doom Scar here. Uh, are we going to Doom Scar here? No, not yet. Or tell that first. It doesn't say why the hell am I still around. It says I know why the hell am I still around. It needed a full stop. Yeah, it needs a full stop though. Otherwise, it just reads. I know. Why the hell am I still? Yeah, oh, I don't know. Maybe. Two whites. So let's do that. Let's doom scar this lot. Before they get something out that can protect it. Ah, oh, Mr. Dean. Hello, sir. How the devil are you, me old marker? Hey, Dean. Thanks for the follow, buddy. Appreciate your fest, sir. Um, we will then play this. Um, we will then... We just copy their speaker at the moment. Do we just copy their speaker? They can't attack. It seems a thing. They're gonna have they're gonna have removal. So I'm just gonna play a Nico at the moment. Um because if I if I waste a Mythos copying their speaker, like mm, very well my friend. What about yourself? Yeah, really good, buddy. Really good. I've got the new mic going, so the stream should frankly sound absolutely shamazeballs, to be honest. Um yeah, it it should sound pretty rank, not gonna lie. Um, we're just going to raven form this straight off the back. Because it exiles it, which is nice. And we've got the mana to do it as well. So which means they can't get it back, which is what, frankly, they want to do. Um, so we'll just go for that. Uh, I got a, a Rode uh, NT1 and then the AI1 uh, studio pack. So it's all uh, Rode NT1... Uh, so it's all shock mounted. It's all it's map high mounted. I've got it all tweaked through um, Voice meter banana. I've obviously got full phantom power off of the road AI one mount uh, and then it all runs through so yeah, it should sound crispier than a fucking crisp thing um, Yeah, so I'm pleased very pleased and apparently according to Yeti who is here all the time the difference is quite quite drastic uh so obviously we'll return saw it coming so when they do get around to playing whatever it is they're going to play they can't which considering they're behind on mana um it's gonna suck they got a cling or something then that they're thinking about clinging it Yeah, no, I'm I'm very very pleased with it. You know, it's it's what you would expect from Rode. Um, it's just really good quality, um, made fantastically. You know, you've probably got three choices uh, for really good microphones. I mean, without going stupid, you've got Rode, Audio Technica, and Shure are sort of your three options without spending thousands and thousands of pounds. I had a Blue Yeti before this, which I managed to tweak to get sounding good. But when I when I say I can get a Blue Yeti sounding good, and I did get the Blue Yeti sounding a lot more of a microphone than it was, when you compare it to this, there is 
absolutely no comparison. Like, the quality of this compared to what I got the Blue Yeti to is a different fucking world. Really is. Has this person crashed out? Are we just getting roped because they're annoyed that they've missed 75 mana drops? What do we reckon? Probably. But it's not too loud though, is it? Even when I'm just sort of like talking loud. It's got a voice, it's got a voice cap on it, so it shouldn't sound like I'm shouting down the thing. It should sound about the same. Perfectly balanced. Okay, that's what I thought. I'm just looking at my levels on here. I've got my levels for other stuff, but yeah. Okay. We're just getting roped for the sake of getting roped. Interesting. I feel I feel blessed. I reckon this person's crashed out. Either that or they're just trying to be annoying. What do you reckon? I've just realised I'm still in my deck tech screen as well. Let's go to the other screen, shall we? I had a thought as well. Do you think it would look better if I moved my webcam up oh so slightly so I'm not chopping off my lands? Or do you think smack bang in the middle is fine? I'm just looking at it kind of going, meh. I think we're going to get a freebie here, boys and girls. Well, technically, it's exactly the same side. It's just the camera's flipped. So to be honest with you, you're looking at exactly the same side of my face. <laughs> Just technically, I'm upside down in the other one. Do you reckon this guy's roping me? No? Okay. Yeah, I can I can, I can, can run slightly higher. What do you think? Yes? Nudge it up a... Nudge it up a... Fucking Nat's Whisker. Is the AHH anything? I'm assuming you two aren't brothers or anything random like that. Maybe you are. Peep. Play the Triome. Probably not a good idea, but... We, we got mana up for the coming as well. That's fine. Wow. Okay, so elves. Okay, so we want these guys to stop ramping. So... Um, we want to make sure we've got mana online for wrath. So we want that. Um... Let's put the Raven form down first. I feel like we're going to get the most mileage out of that. I mean, they're going to be able to... They're going to be able to ramp. Okay, I wish Warmaster. So we Raven form the Warmaster. Exile that. This is not going to be easy. I mean, the Storm's Wrath works quite well in our favour. It's meaningless. Okay. Um, see, so we get. I've got 26 land in this deck, chat, and I'm being screwed on land. Can someone explain to me how that's a thing? Because I'd love to know how I've missed land drops, and I've got 26 land in the deck. Shuffle is fine, by the way. Harold, what are they gonna hit? Oh, they're playing the they're playing the realm walker. Interesting. Oh yeah, shuffle not broken at all. It just makes me want to fold because it's like, like, why? So now they got one, like three, six, seven, eight, nine. It's three land drops. Fuck no. I've still lost. Like, I can't, I can't win. If I can't win with 26 land in my, if I got 26 land in my deck, um, because Wizard of the Coast doesn't, because Watsy doesn't like me. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Well, but it's like, uh, like how, how? It feels so bad though. It's like you deliberately put land in. You play a control deck. You know, you want to hit lands, so you run 26 lands, and you still miss land drops. It's like, really, really, really. Like, I'm not convinced. Like, I'm thoroughly unconvinced.
Right, let's see if we can actually hit land drops here. Okay, decent amount of land. Behold the multiverse, raven form. I think, well, with a Garak. So we're going to play... Yeah, so we're playing Golgari something. Probably want to do the Behold the Multiverse or maybe the Mystic Reflection. There's only one in the deck. I do quite like it. But you need something shit to aim it at. Discard a card. Um, I kind of want to discard the land because I feel like I can get away with it. So let's discard the red basic. Um, let's then play. I feel like because I want access to Storm's Wrath. I'm going to play this. And then I'm going to play this. Because I feel like I'm going to be queuing up against a Garrick at some point. So. Snow as well but are they just playing snow for the sake of playing snow you know there's a lot of that going on at the moment like people literally just playing snow because interesting okay I feel like I want to get the epiphany out of my hand so they don't really know what I'm doing if I play this on red get this out my hand using the two red leaves up the mystic reflection if they play a four drop so I can four drop I'm going to have to discard a card for it but I can discard the raven form Hey, Will. How you doing, buddy? Nice to see you here, dude. Yeah, so cool. So copy that. Have it target this. Okay. So have another dude. Uh, and I'll discard. I'm going to discard the multiverse here. Good, bud. Y yeah, really good, man. I've just got the new mic on the go, so I'm frankly really pleased about that. Because um, it sounds chamaze balls. Um, I think we want to be able to draw cards here, so uh, we'll lay this away and then we'll just chill. I mean, we've got Storm's Wrath online, so if they play another questing bitch, um, we should be good. How you been? Anyway, Will, how's all the streams going? It's lovely to see you, man. Really good to see you. Whenever you cast a creature spell, if snow of any colour spent to do annoying shit okay so we've got double blue we want to start getting white mana online um we don't want to start getting run over so we probably storms wrath here um we could wait another turn but i feel like i'm gonna get my hand attacked in a minute um and this hmm or do we just raven form maybe we just maybe we raven form this and then hold on to the Storm's Wrath for another turn. So I think we hard cast this now. Um, hard cast this now. Um, which takes their snow mechanic offline. And then we just we just fucking hot chill. We've got Behold the Multiverse on their turn. I see you got a new one. How much was it? Uh, I got suckered into a blue Yeti and kind of want a new one. So I had a blue Yeti. I tweaked mine. So this is the Rode Studio Pack. So this is the Rode NT1 and the uh, AI1 uh, audio unit. Uh, it's, well, as you can hear, it sounds fucking awesome. Um, it does sound really, really good. Like, the guys that are always in the stream, literally, they, they sound like the noticeable difference. Flying lifelink hexproof from Planeswalkers with Boast. Fine. Um, yeah, we'll let that resolve. We can Storm's Wrath that away. So that was a good wait, frankly. Nice. But yeah, I'm really pleased with it, Will. But it's, I think I got it, I got mine off of uh, Amazon, an Amazon dealer, and it was a shade under 300. So, but however, mate, it's just really, really good. Really good. I'm super pleased. 
Um, saw it coming is nice. The land is nice. Okay, so we'll... Doom Scar's good as well. Okay. But we'll Wrath to start off with. Um, and then what we'll do is we'll get the Doom Scar ready. Nice. It is, but for the fact that you get the microphone, you get the shock mount, you get a pop filter, you get the uh, audio unit because it's a, an XLR mic, um, and you get the lead, and you get the USB. So that's all. That's everything. Like that's literally everything you need. Um, cool. We got double white. Yeah, we have got double white. So we'll play this for blue. We'll put the. We'll put the. Why is it? It's it's obsessed with tapping blue. I don't want to tap blue. I'm gonna tap the reds. Like, for those, just everyone be aware, the auto-tapper for Fortel sucks donkey wang. It really does. Um, it tries to actively screw you over all the time. I've got not, not got mine on auto-tap. Um, yeah, we'll let that resolve, because we can doomscar it. Okay, so do this. Now, what's the worst case scenario here? Because we can still doom scar this. So, right. We wait. They tap out for a load of shit. They attack, which they're going to because we're not going to have anything to defend. They untap, they make a massive play. So I think we have to Doom Scar and then leave up the saw it coming. Because this is just not cool. This this is gonna lead to horrific shit occurring. So we, we can't wait. As much as it as much as it's like a Doom Scar for one dude. Like, so What do you reckon they're playing poison? Okay. I'm gonna take an extra turn now. And try and find some more stuff, I think. Take an extra turn. Gives us some blockers as well. And try and set up a mechanic a little bit better. Yeah, this is standard, mate. So what have they got? They're looking through my graveyard. So have they got a cling? Yeah, this is standard. Um... I'm not a massive fan of standard, but I tell you what, um, this standard's growing on me. It really is. It, it feels a little bit, dare I say it, a little bit more like modern because you've got really cracked out stuff you can do. You can play elves. There's sort of artifact synergies going on. There's lots of um, like graveyard sort of, um, what's the word I'm looking for? like um graveyard recurring effects i just i'm really liking it i'm really really liking it um because i think they're going to be playing um some form of infect i'm going to leave something up for this dude no <laughs> streamlabs beat you to the uh the bad hammer there yet okay we'll end the turn there i just want to get my mechanic online because black and well green can get rid of enchantments for sure but they don't generally play it. Not main board. We're only playing best of one as well. Because best of one reasons. Well done, Yetz. You drop that fucking hammer, babe. Get it done. Get it done. Kogler. They've tapped out for Kogler. So when Kogler enters the battlefield, it fights one target creature you don't control. When Koga attacks, destroy target artifact or enchantment. Fuck no. Uh let's just let's just get rid of it. Let's just get rid of it. I've tapped out for it. And if we get we can potentially take another turn here. So we'll get rid of you. Okay, nice. So we'll gain some life. Okay, cool. Um Okay, fine. So, they weren't up for the...
they weren't up for the uh, the long game, clearly. Uh, <laughs> Side note, trade for all Urza's towers, you can. I'm collecting them. You can. <laughs> Are you just trying to buy out? <laughs> Are you literally just trying to buy out all the Urza's towers? I've literally just got a full set of every single one because I just think it's one of those things that's eventually going to be worth having one all of. Not that I ever intend to play Tron because I actively hate it the same as you. Um, so we've got all of our pieces. We want to get this out of our hand pretty sharpish. Um, we've got red mana. We've got blue mana. We've got white mana. So we'll play this on blue to start off with. We want to try and get the epiphany down so they don't know what we're doing. We're going to build a tower of towers, then burn it to the ground. <laughs> okay, so we've got a second one now. Um, so to be honest with you, oh, I didn't mean to do that. Balls. Um, it's because I'm not concentrating. Um, we'll put the Doom Scar down. God damn it. Birth. Okay, so this is going to be what? Doom? I should imagine. We'll play... Play Red Mana. We'll get one of these out of our hand. This has got to be Dance of the Mance, Doom Foretold, right? Midnight Clock. Okay. Yeah, I don't really care about that so much. Uh, we can Raven form that anyway. So, to be honest with you, the fact that they want it means I want it more. So, we'll foretell that. For red and blue. Another Mythos of a Luma. See, again, like 26 lands in the deck. Missing land drops, by the way. The fact that they want this means that I just want it even fucking more. Solemn, and they've tapped out. They can't protect it. We could Raven form the Solemn. I let that resolve. Um. Do we just create a copy of Solemn for the moment? I think we create a copy of Solemn for the moment as a blocker. Let us find our white mana. Let's create a copy of Solemn. I will take that action. And I would like some white mana, please. So we can block. We can get our card draw as well. We can Raven form their Midnight Clock in a minute. Yeah, I'll have card draw. Thanks. Cool. Give me the cards. Come say draw a card. Take the action. Boop. Land. Nice. Okay, cool. So we can... Another Solemn. This has just got to be like Ramp, Ugin bullshit, right? So... Okay, play this. Let's Raven form their Midnight Clock, because... And it'll tell us if they've got Counter Magic, which they have, because it's, it's held up. Okay, so they don't want it that much. Um... We'll put another one of these to one side for the minute. Um, and to be honest with you, we'll get the other one out of our hand as well, so they can't see it. I mean, what's the worst case scenario here? Three, four, five, six, seven. Ugin next turn, but we can Mythos their Ugin. So I'm actually going to get this out of my hand as well. So if they Ugin next turn, which... Okay, that's what held it up. It was the Omen that held it up, so not counter magic. Okay. Because Dance is 
His dance just... Okay, Dream Trawler. That's fine. We can just Doom Scar the Dream Trawler. Just Doom Scar that. I, I, I assume they've got a counter. Okay, no. So if they tap out for another Dream Trawler, um, which I'm pretty sure they will. No, Midnight Clock. Okay, they really want all their stuff back, don't they? Um, okay. So. I want more white mana. Right, worst case scenario. I think I just go for it. I'm just going to go for it. YOLO. YOLO. Like, what's the worst case scenario here? ECD? Surely ECD, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. So that's fine. So they're just sitting on that. They want their stuff back. Wow, they're just going to tap out for it. Interesting. Uh, and this is three or greater. So I'll take an extra turn while they've tapped out, because that seems dumb. Um, I will then copy their ECD, taking their ECD. Uh, I'll then play this to gain some life. Um, I'll get a nug in now because they're not going to have haste with whatever they've got okay so we assume they have tons of ECDs right there we go so all the time they're doing this perfect so what do you reckon I reckon actively not running counters So we definitely want to get rid of this because they really want this to go off, right? So let that resolve. We're going to take an extra turn. We'll then this to one side for our next turn. Uh, we'll give them a punch in the head. Uh, they can then get their counter. Let that resolve. They can get their graveyard back, but I'm not sure I actively fucking care. Um, we'll draw some cards. Saw it coming and double vision. Okay, yeah. So we'll put this to one side. So we can protect it. We'll put this to one side. So we can protect our double vision. We don't care about taking two. So we'll punch them. So. Okay. Yeah they get their graveyard back. But I don't think we really care too much. They don't seem to be running counter magic. Um, Dream trawler. Okay so we can doom scar that again. Midnight clock gone. Please tap out for it like a fucking idiot. Wow. Okay. So we're expensive turn next turn. So they've got two up. So they can discard to give it hex proof. So I think we just get this down. We've got Sorik coming available to use next turn. Um, so we can take two extra turns after this. So no attacks at the moment. World of Gaming! I know you're not in here, but thank you so much for subscribing over on YouTube. Appreciate you. Hey, Monkey Player, how you doing, buddy? Welcome, welcome, welcome. How you doing, buddy? New microphone be sounding 
proper baller in the turn. So as long as we can get to an... They don't appear to be running counter magic. So, you know, we've got blockers for this fuck nugget here. Um, it's going to tap. Birth, so we don't really care about that. Like, how many extra turns? We already used three. So, we need to fucking give him a punching here. So, five, six, seven. I think we take seven. Hey! Lunamello, how you doing? Another one. Um, do I care about another one? If I wrath on one of my extra turns. And they've tapped out... They've got blue mana from the midnight clock. Um, I think we let that resolve because we can wrath the board. And we've got saw it coming to protect the wrath as well. Okay, so let that resolve. Okay, let's take extra turns. Like, they're probably not running counter magic, so do that. Do that. Um, play that. Gain some life. Attack with all of that. Okay. So, that. Then we foretell this. Luna Mello, thank you so much for the follow. Appreciate your face. Thank you very much. Okay, so we'll now go next. Wing with everything again. We'll then play this, wrath the board. Uh, let that resolve. Uh, we'll get back the hold the multiverse. Um, they clearly want to get their ship back, so we'll raven form their clock. Yeah, fine. Uh, yeah, resolves. Hey, Lemo. 11 months without magic trying to catch up with the meta game. Uh, to be honest with you, if you want to know meta game, I'm probably actively the worst streamer you could probably come and watch. I do not play. I do not play the meta game. Is that all my extra turns? One, two, three. I've got one more. There's one more in there. Cool. Uh, yeah, resolve. And resolve. Cool. So they're clearly not playing counters. We've got two of their dream caller. At the beginning of your end step, draw a card. If your life total is great, then you're starting life total. Otherwise, you gain two life. Um, yeah, fine. Get rid of that. Uh, decline that. So, I would assume they've got another one, right? Hopefully not. Because where's the fun? Where's the fun if I actively can't carry on being annoying? So we've killed two of their dream trawlers. You would assume in a deck like this they're running four. There's three midnight clocks in exile. I even know the names of the new cards. Your stream is awesome. <laughs> Thanks, buddy. 
Well, appreciate that. Thank you very much. And thank you very much for becoming a crazy mythical creature and following as well, man. Really appreciate you for that. Thank you. So I think we can almost actively assume at the moment they're not running counter magic. We'll draw some cards. Uh, saw it coming, yes. But not anything else. Doom Scar's nice. Okay, cool. So we'll put this to one side. Uh, we'll put this to one side. Uh, what have we got up? Blue, white, white. So two blues, two whites, two reds. So we'll have more blue mana. Um, and then we'll end the turn there. He calls everyone, man. Don't worry about it. Or do you? Oh, sorry. Girl. Luna Mello. Sorry, I just call everyone dude and mate and buddy. So I do apologise. Everyone gets it. Lagging. Uh, yeah, a little bit, but it should stop. I, I was getting I was getting lag spikes last time. Um, it should sort itself out in a minute, man. Fingers crossed. It's well up at the moment. It's like just jumping around a bit. We need to save the Doom Scars and the Sorit Cummings. Okay, sweet. So we'll... Put that to one side. Um, I don't want a Storm's Wrath here. Because a Storm's Wrath... Will a Storm's Wrath? No, it doesn't hit a Dream Trawler. Hits everything else, though. Uh, we've got plenty of life at the moment. I'm not too fussed. Yeah, it, it'll, it'll sort itself out in a minute. We've only missed... We've only missed a couple of frames. It's back to normal now, so it should be fine. Um, yeah, in the turn there. Nice. How long have you been playing? Okay, ECD. So you want to get your stuff back. So we'll get rid of that. Fine. Get rid of that. Have they got another one? What do we reckon? Probably not, because they're attacking now. So, fine. I'm kind of tempted to... I still want to draw on... I know I could draw more if I wait until my turn. But I feel like, you know, let's just, if we get the extra turn, we kind of want that for, ah, oh, Mythos, nice. Okay, cool. Um, so, we don't need the land, but we do want the Mythos, because then that protects the double vision then. Cool. Excellent. So we'll Mythos this. Mythos this again. Uh, we'll Raven form that. Uh, we'll draw some cards. Land. Land's not that helpful. Um, I'm not fussed about taking three at the moment. I think that's perfectly fine. Um, and then we've got three copies of Double Vision now as well um, to protect it. What's my win con? Uh, take a million turns create a shitload of ravens, punch them in the head, but it's kind of difficult because um, we've got one extra shot at it, so we've got to be really careful with our last extra turns, so we'll see. they got 22 left. Like... End the turn. I'm not fast. We can take three. Three is fine. Basically, take a million turns, create a million ravens. Generally, be an asshole. But they're they're basically frantically searching for like dream trawlers and vanishing lights. And how many ECDs have we got? One, two. We got three ECDs out of their hand. So it's like, and they're down to what 19 cards. So we can storms wrath. Wow. Really? Okay. How many double visions? I, I should have loads. Like, I've still got two more in the deck. So, you know, reasons. 
Uh, let's play more blue mana. Uh, let's next. Let's end the turn. Right, that's fine for us, frankly. Well, shit. I wasn't. I wasn't expecting the Ondu inversion. I must admit, all the lands. Like we can deal with Dream Trawlers. We can deal with Dream Trawlers. I mean, you know, ECD. So they're trying to get back a Dream Trawler, basically, with this. Okay, so. Put this to one side. We've just got to chill. Like, we've got more than enough mana that paying two more for stuff. Yeah, so I'm copying extra turns with double vision. And then you cast... <laughs> Too much mana. Um, then you're then you cast um, Mythos of Illumi to copy the copy of the doubling spell, and you end up with tons. So it ends up like take ex eight extra turns, create six ravens. Like so, there goes another ECD. So that's all of their ECDs. Um, you know, there goes another Dream Trawler because they can't get it back anymore. Uh, we'll put down the Sorit coming. Because we're gonna we we're gonna win the we're gonna win the um we're gonna win the uh, the library battle. So we need to be careful with this. We just need to chill on this now for a bit until we got another double vision, um, and then we're all good. We just need to chill. We need to hot chill on the epiphany. Um, so we need to counter that. That's all their dream trawlers gone. One, two, three. Okay, so. Play the Mystic Reflection. End of the turn. Got nine cards left and we've got 19. Okay. Play the White Manor. Um, in the turn. Come on. Don't want any more land. Cool. Double vision. Um, so now, how many Mythos? One, two, three. There's another Mythos in there. Okay. End the turn. Nice. So now we can use the Mystic Reflection as a counter spell for the um, last Dream Trawler. So we'll Raven form the Solemn so they can't get their card draw as well. Banishing Light. Um, fine. Resolve. One. There's one in there. Two. Three. There's one more. There's one more double vision. Uh, my turn. Okay, there's the Meath of, of Aluma. So, we'll play the Mythos. Hang on, or do we? Do we, do we, do we? We'll Raven form this. Um, we need to keep that around. To deal with the dream trawler. They've only got six cards. Um, we can deal with that if we really need it. With the mythos. We've got an extra turn. Which we can't afford to take yet. Because we need to deck them. We're playing We're playing decking them now. I got to diamond. Uh, yeah you can draw cards. Draw as many cards as you like chief. Okay. 
Okay. Two to the bottom. What's he got in there? Pass. Pass. Seven life and four cards. So this raven can't kill me. This raven actively cannot kill me. Um, we don't need an extra turn yet. Raven form. So we're happy. We're happy to chill. So they're scrying. So they've only got four cards left. So what's that? One to the top, one to the bottom. End the turn. 14 cards left. So, you ready for this? Mystic Reflection. Targeting this. Comes in as a copy of a bird. There you go. There's their last Dream Trawler gone. That's all their Dream Trawlers. They've, like, they've got no Dream Trawlers. So we'll put the Sorit coming to one side. They have three cards left. Um, we will then get rid of this. Targeting this. We'll just set ourselves up now. So we'll take some extra turns. Two more. Two more. Um. There we go. We've only got to do moderately stupid stuff. Fifty percent at six games is bad. What? Fifty-fifty. Win one three, lost three. That's fine. Nothing wrong with that. Um. We'll play White Manor. Doesn't necessarily tell people a lot. Need Blue Manor. Okay. Okay. Food or Mono Green? Need Blue Manor. There's tons of Blue Manor in the deck. People aren't really playing Mutate. Not that I've seen, anyway. Um, so we'll put that as well. Play the double white. You kind of meet a few a day, really. See, I've not come across Mutate at all. Uh, so we'll play blue. We'll then put away Saw It Coming. It's so tempting to fuck their goose now. Uh, I might wait to Doomscar it. This has got to be a food deck, right? This is just food. This is mono green food. Definitely. This is, this is food. Again, look, look how many, look how many land drops I'm missing though, right? Defo food now. I've never seen food deck. Food's good. I've got, a, I've got a really good food deck. I'm kind of tempted to get their goose and take them off their ramp. Because like, they could play questing beast next turn. I kind of feel like I want to stop them making food. Uh, let's Raven form there, this. Because whatever they do next turn, we can Doom Scar it anyway. So at least let's stop some making food. Crawling Barons, okay. Ow. There we go. What a surprise. What did I say? Questing Beast. We copy their. Uh, let's just let's just get rid of it. Weird, they ate a food though. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe they might just animate their crawling barons here. What?
Okay. Um, we need red mana because they're not going to be able to get rid of double vision. Um, do we just sit and chill for a minute? Because if they create something big and Larry, we can just copy it with Mythos. But ideally, we just want our red mana so we can start popping off. Looks like they're going to animate their barons. They're hovering over it. Here we go. Uh, yeah, let that resolve. Okay, so we'll draw some cards. Try and set ourselves up. We want red mana. Okay, Epiphany, yes. We've got a Storm's Wrath. We'll take the Epiphany, because that's part of a puzzle. Blue mana. That's fine. So we'll put this to one side again. Um, we'll put this aside as well. That still leaves us up. Saw it coming. Okay, cool. We're good. We're good. It is weird that they ate the food if they're a food deck. Yeah, it is strange. I feel like they're looking for a giant so they can then play a henge or something. But like you would expect to be seeing questing be um love struck beasts and things. Um I feel like that's gonna get out of control, so and it's hard to get rid of. Um so we'll get rid of that now. Eating food. I don't... Okay. Blue mana. Um... Where's our red mana? <laughs> we need red mana chat. Everyone does need to eat food. I'm expecting a troll. But we'll just copy their troll. So... What are they going to do? Start hitting me with their barons. No, they're just powering it up. So I can actually create a token that's a copy of Crawling Baron, so I can copy their land. They eat their food again. Let that resolve. Pass to attacks. Alright, let's draw some cards again. Um, we don't want an extra turn yet. I feel like we'll take another Behold the Multiverse, because it lets us have another stab. Okay, Triumph's good. My turn. That solves our problem. We'll play that. We'll then put the Doom Scar to one side. Put the Multiverse to one side. We're still representing Counter Magic, which is good. Goose. Fine. Um, like the likelihood of them running some sort of enchantment destruction is very slim. I feel like they're just going to eat food again. Because Crawling Barons hasn't got Trample. I mean, they might just give it Trample. Are they going to hit me? No. Okay. I'll draw some cards. Ideally, we just want land here. Uh, no, I just want land, really. Uh, so, let's get this down. We've got another, we've got a backup. I don't want to lay Sank away because I want them to think I've got counter magic. So I'm not actually going to play this because I want them to think I've got something. Goose, that's fine. Are they going to try and hit me now? With their baron? They haven't. They've tapped their barons. They're just eating food. Okay. Oh, this is going to go so bad for them. 
So, red mana. Meath offers of a Luna. Copy this. Copy this. Um, then... One, two, three, four, five, six. We've already copied a spell, so we don't want to do it this turn. Um, keep the Storm's Wrath. We'll get the birds to one side so we can deal with any shit that goes on. And then we pop off next turn. Hey, Paul. Hey, everyone. Can you give a shout out to uh, Paul for us, please, Yeti? The new mic is sounding rather good. Crawling Barons, eight. Can you kill me? Can they kill me? What do we reckon? Henge. Okay. If they don't kill me this turn, I I just go mental. Okay, seven. Okay, oh, we got another one. Here we go. You ready? Oh dear. We're doing the thing. We're doing the thing, Rue. The thing's happening, Rue. You turned up just in time. We're doing the thing. Uh, we're doing the, we're doing degenerate things. We're, we're being degenerate, Rue. Uh, degenerate time. Um, we then Raven form this. So if it blocks, it dies. Yeah. Dumb things happened. End turn. Start an extra turn. Put the Sorit coming to one side just in case. Uh, we then swing. I think they're dead. I don't think there's anything I can do about it. I, I think they're dead. I don't think there's a lot they can do. I think I think they're pretty fucked. Cool. Uh, uh, cool. Do it again. This is three extra turns. Copy it. Four. Make more dudes. That's five. That's six. That's seven extra turns. Uh, end the turn. Uh, next, 16. Swing. You've got two life from your henge, henge and your food. Yeah, next. Cool. Uh, draw some cards. This is an artifact. They so will raven form their henge. Uh, we'll just for gigs and shittles. We'll raven form one of their foods. Raven form another one of their foods. We did target their henge, right? Yeah, it's already targeted it. Fine. Raven form another one of their foods. Raven form their henge. Um, play blue mana. Uh, play another copy of Double Vision. Good game. Send him the love. Um, 
Next. Swing with everything. <laughs> we did the thing! <laughs> is there an extra turn counter? Yeah, there is. We were on five. It's just, it's just, it's just here. We, we, were, we were on eight extra turns. Just saying hello to my lovely girlfriend because she's been at work all day, bless her. Uh, do we want to keep this? Two lands, card draw, one part of the engine. Um, yeah, we'll keep it. What, copy all their spells? Oh, we got one person's with these emo spam bots, have we? Okay, cool. So we we definitely want the um, the doom scar down uh, to deal with any of their bullshit they're going to be doing. So this is going to be angels. Yeah. Okay. Cool. That's fine. Um, so, we'll play this, we'll play this, because we can hang fire on this for a minute. Um... I just copy their speaker here. Um, I think we just Raven form their speaker. Raven form this. Um, then let's uh, get our card draw going. We've got two pieces of the puzzle. Okay, so but to be honest with you, we'll just straight Raven form this now. Indestructible, we don't care. Indestructible, we can deal with. How did they even make that a dude? How did, how did they make? Oh, animating fairy. Okay. Um, we'll just gain some life here, I think, for a minute. Uh, so what we'll do, we'll get this out of our hand. We'll gain some life. Um. Oh, right. Okay. Um. Okay. So we'll use that to. Uh, oh, or do we just? Uh, maybe we put it into the Doom Skull. Put them back a turn. We'll foretell that. I think we can hang fire for a minute. Because I think we can hit something. We can hit other stuff that's going to be better. Engine six life. What do you mean? Okay, so we'll now... Or tell this. Um, and then next, and we'll end the turn. We'll draw some cards at the end next turn. 
Oh, what? I, 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 I could be copying their gain six life. Yeah. I just, I just can't see it. I just can't see it helping. And it's another expensive spell as well. That's what you've got to remember is Lithoform Engine isn't a cheap spell. Yeah, but I get two exiles off the other one, so it doesn't really matter. Um, I'll get back the Raven form. Uh, I'll play the double vision. I'll play red mana. Don't they gonna have an exile effect? Animating fairy. Brazen bullshit. Interesting. Cool. Okay, fine. Be gone. Um. End of turn. I mean, they're mana screwed. I mean, they've clearly got a million brazen borrowers in hand. Like. Cool. Mythos, um, ideally. Okay, Raven form this. And Wrath. Play blue mana. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So we can play, we can double vision and mythos, depending on what they do. Why, why Raven? What, why have Raven form in the deck? Um, so we can copy their Skyclave and Skyclave their Heliod. We can then copy their Skyclave and Skyclave their Skyclave. So, if they bounce this, the Skyclave kills me. So, untap, Brazen Borrower that, and then their Skyclave kills me. So. I need to do this. Copy this. I need to do this to live. End the turn. At least this way I live. What do you mean by why Raven, Rue? Boy, bitch, what? Oh, deck list screen. Sorry. Thank y'all. Um.
We need to take some extra turns because we need blockers. So we can't get away from that. Um, we don't want to be able to do that. So we'll raven form this. Um, we'll swing with this because we can. Uh, end the turn. We'll play the double vision. Because now if we Doom Scar, we can get rid of the token. Because now if we Doom Scar, the Doom Scar, Doom Scar goes off twice. So the Doom Scar will go off there. 2-2 two, two will 3-3 three, three will come back and then we'll hit it. I mean, bear in mind, this is a pretty meta deck. They're going to animate that. Block you. Block you. Not got trample. They get... Dude. Put this to one side. Um, we can then... Storm's Wrath. Still leaves up, saw it coming. End the turn. Come on, give me some stuff to work with. Heliod. We can't let that resolve. Okay, so we can gain some life. End the turn. So borrow that, fine. We can replay it. Heliod. Or tell that. Play this. And the turn. So we can draw a shed load of cards. They're not going to have haste. Uh, no, I'm not, mate. No, I'm, there's, there's no creatures in the deck. Uh, was it up to four? Up to four. So they can't hit this. And if I Doom Scar, I get a 3-3. Three, three. Yeah, fine resolves. Hey, buddy. How you doing, Ben? Brazen Borrower. Fine. Hey, draw me some cards. Nope, don't want land. I need answers. Answers, extra turns. Mythos is good. Saw it coming, I don't need at the moment. I need extra turns. Yes, okay. Um, so, blue mana. Mythos this. Then Doom Scar them.
Uh, let that resolve. Uh, foretell this. Um, and the turn. Okay, we're turning the corner. We're turning the corner, slowly but surely. Okay. As long as they're not playing... This deck's probably not playing counter magic, right? Do we let this happen? Not got haste. They can't give it haste. So do we care? No, let that resolve. Not going to have haste. We let that happen. Okay. Play white mana. We now take shitloads of extra turns. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. Yeah, fine. So, two extra turns, three extra turns. So, we're currently on three extra turns. Put that to one side. Uh, we'll swing with our 3-3. Three, three. Make them block. Play this. Swing with everything. So we've got three extra turns after this. Play blue mana. Swing with everything. We've got two extra turns. We need to find something though. We need to make sure we leave up blockers. Okay. Um, play another copy of double vision. Still got an extra turn after this one. That with everything. And they're dead. From one life. From one life. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. That was so much fun. Loved it. Loved it. Loved it. One of my favourite decks ever. Um, if you liked it as well, make sure you just smash the like button to let me know. If you want to see more crazy decks like that, the best way to let me know is by liking the video and telling me in the comments if you want to see anything particular. I'd love to hear about that. Apart from that, do all the normal things. Make sure you are subscribed if you're not subscribed already and go and check out one of these cool Magic the Gathering videos from the channel. Apart from that, I'm going to crack on and brew some more craziness. See you next time. Peace.